Looking for an 11 speed driver this Christmas? How about this one? Not to your liking? Why not try this one? Yeah, I like to keep two drivers handy because every once in a while I like to change things up. And that's good because sometimes I just don't feel like myself. Spin it. Hey DMD family, welcome back to another Discs MD video. Bunky here and we're going to do another disc review for Lone Star. Day 11 of Vlogmas now. We're close to halfway. We're about halfway through Vlogmas. So uh, this, is, this is taking a little more work than I, than I anticipated, but it's worth it. I love it and I uh, hope you're getting something out of it. Today we're going to review uh, two 11 speeds. I call them the sister drivers. Uh, it's the Nimitz. And the curl. So both of them are 11.5, uh, negative one, and then the curl is a two fade, and the Nimitz is a three fade, so a little more overstable. The Nimitz is a little more overstable. Both very reliable. If you throw them up to speed, they will flip up to flat for you, right? If you put them on a little hyzer, they will flip up to flat on uh, for you, and then reliable dump off to the right at the end um i love the curl if i really juice the curl and put it on flat it will turn over for me and ride out a little bit before it comes crashing back to the right uh the nimitz is a little tougher to do that with just because i think the profile of the nimitz is different so i don't know if you can see it or not so there's the profiles and do you see the nimitz the the nimitz to me almost feels like mid-rangey like it has this and i'll we'll try to disguise my see do you see the ridge there do you see how that flares it it almost it almost feels like a mid-range uh as an 11 speed uh about halfway through the rim about halfway through the rim it juts down um a pretty sh steep angle and it took me a while to get used to that feel from a distance driver but I tell you what, uh, it does exactly what it's supposed to do, and it does it the same every time. So really reliable uh, distance driver, 11 speed. And then the curl, uh, you can see, is not as... And was that my number? That's all right. It's not as drastic underneath as the Nimitz is. Feels like your standard you know, distance driver, 11 speed rim. And again, very comfortable in the hand, very comfortable to throw. Again, both of these are in the Bravo plastic. So... We're going to go over to the wreck and throw them a little bit, uh, throw them on hyzer, uh, let you see them flip up, and then I'll try to throw them flat and see if I can get the curl to fade out and then and then dump back. And then we'll forehand them again. Again, I don't do much forehanding, so uh, I don't know if I've ever forehanded either of these discs, but we'll give it a shot. So let's hold, head on over to the wreck and get to throwing them. All right, out here at the wreck, I'm going to do things a little differently this time than in the past. So I'm going to throw both of these on Heiser, Flat, and Anheuser just to show you what they're doing. I'll put the distances up top too. Um, there's a little tailwind, so we'll see. We'll see how we do today. Well, there you have it. Heiser flat and Anheuser for each of these. You can see that the distances got steadily better as I went. 
Although the flat with the curl came out of my hand really nice. But about halfway through the flight, a big gust of wind knocked it out of the sky, Kevin Jones style. So, but anyway, there you have it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick forehand with them just for you to see. Just do one forehand. My forehand's not good enough to do Heiser, flat man Heiser yet. I'm just, I'm hoping it comes out of my hand clean. So let me just forehand them both for you real quick and then we'll wrap it up. <sighs> Oh, there you have it. Four hands. My forehand's still garbage. I'm still working on it. A lot of practice left to do, but Josh is getting me there. But uh, there you have it. The Nimitz and the Curl. Sister drivers, both uh, 11 five ones, and then a Nimitz negative three, Curl negative two. Again, really reliable drivers to do what you want them to do. Uh, I know that I can torque on those things, and they're going to fly and not get out of control. But uh, if you're looking for an 11 speed, those two are, are fantastic drivers from the Lone Star lineup. Thanks for coming along. Hope you learned something about the discs. Hope you enjoyed the content. Hope you enjoy the rest of Vlogmas. Until next time, enjoy the journey. And here's your verse of the day. <laughs>